I'm here in Shanghai uh, in front of a very important building called the Hongqiao Lingkong Building. I'm here in China to discuss with leaders efforts to build a greener economy, an inclusive growth that also protects the environment. I've learned here that the people of Shanghai are on absolutely the cutting edge of building cleaner cities. This building employs technologies that are way ahead of its time. Uh, it has uh, reduced the consumption dramatically and it's paving the way for much cleaner buildings all over the world. Uh, the manager of this building told me that it actually cost a lot of money to get this going, but his company was committed to it because they wanted to show that it could be done. The government in this area came in right behind him and now has made the standards that they've set the standards for the entire city. This is a fantastic example of how private sector innovation linked to public sector commitment can lead to much cleaner cities. We're here in hopes of encouraging uh, the government, the private sector, and the people of Shanghai to keep moving in the direction of building cleaner cities. We think that the experiences here can be examples not just for the rest of China, but for the entire world. The battle against climate change is serious. 80% uh, of the energy use in this country is happening in cities. And if we can make cities cleaner and more efficient, we can take a big step who are truly battling climate change.